Hi everyone, today I'm going to share my birthday stroke Cyber Monday Black Friday haul with you. Um, I got a lot of vouchers and money for my birthday, which I spent um, over the sale weekend. So I've got quite a few dolls, some that were gifts and some that I've um, bought with my birthday money and vouchers. So, first of all, I have Disney animator... Flynn, and um, he's my second boy animator doll. Why oh, isn't he cute? He's got the moulded on hair, and he comes with the um, Maxim. I think that's Maximus the horse. Yeah, and the box has got the. Um, it's not the same as the other animator boxes because they have like these sort of pictures all over around the sides and everyone everything. Whereas this one has got, although it's got drawings, they're not drawings of Flynn. But yeah, there are some cute drawings of him on the back. Yeah, I will be doing an unboxing of these dolls as well, so that'll come later. Next I got um, Claudine and Claude Wolf. Um, and this is the, I think it's the, foot, I think they're playing f American football, that's what I think. Claude's got a pom-pom and, uh, and uh, Claudine's got a football. Love this pack. And they're the daughter and son of werewolves, yeah. This was, um, these were all, I didn't pay, well, not, yeah, I didn't pay full price for any of these dolls. I think there's probably one, one doll that I paid full price for, and that was by, quite by accident. Yeah, the Monster Highs will buy one, get one free. Uh, then I have um, MC Squared, Project MC Squared, Adrienne's Lemon Soap Experiment, and... She comes with all the equipment to make lemon soap and you have to provide the um, ingredients. Yeah, and she's in her masquerade ball outfit. Yeah, so that's her. These were 25% off, so that's good. This is the one that I paid full price for. Like I say, it was quite accidental and it wasn't until I checked my receipt when I got home that I realised that she they had charged me full price for her and she wasn't full price at the point of sale um but by then it was too late because um the shop that i bought her from was quite a long way away yeah so yes yeah, so i did actually pay full price for crystal crystal winter daughter of the snow queen she's from um ever after high yeah from the epic winter line yeah she's lovely isn't she and there are a few Ever After High dolls that I don't have, but like Gingerbread House, um, um, I'm trying to think of some of the others. No, I know Gingerbread House is one of them. Oh, and Duchess Swan, I don't have her either. But I've got another one of the um, Project MC Squares Experiment dolls, the ones in there. This is um, Cameron, she's also in her masquerade outfit, and she... It has the um, nail polish experiment. Um, I think the only one I haven't got in this one now, in this um, series, is Bryden. I've got I've got all the others in that in that series, but I can't find Bryden anywhere, which is a a shame. Yeah. I keep looking, but so far I've not seen her. She's, you know, she's not in stock or not available for delivery or, yeah. So maybe I'll get her soon. Maybe I'll get her for Christmas, eh? You never know. Uh, next I have a basic MC squared. And this is Ember Evergreen. And I, I love this doll. I love her ginger hair. I love her freckled face and her blue eyes. She's lovely, isn't she? I love a little daisy dress too. Yeah, really pretty. Yeah. And she, like I say, she's the basic doll, so she's not articulated and she doesn't come with an experiment. Yeah, but she's a nice doll, isn't she? Really nice. I love these MC squared dolls, in case anyone didn't know that already. Yeah. <laughs> right, then I've got... Yeah, all the Project MC squared were 25 cent off. Um, then I got this Neon Lights Evie. She was from a discount store. I think I paid £10 for her. 
which is a really good price for a Disney Descendants doll, isn't it? Yeah, she's the Neon Lights Ball EV. Uh, and she does, if I can make her work, she does light up, but I'm, I'm not sure how to do it. And, oh, there we are, look. You can just see a red dress light glowing. Yeah, can you see that? Yeah. Yeah, she's a really pretty doll as well, isn't she? I love the faces on these Descendants dolls. Yeah, and they're all nicely articulated too. Yeah, don't think she comes with any accessories though, by the look of it. No, I don't have any of the neon lights ones. So yeah, I'm really happy to get that. Um, then I have Lady Tremaine from Cinderella. Um, I've been wanting Lady Tremaine for a while. Um, I saw her when we went on holiday and got her then and she was put away for my birthday present. She um, was from The Entertainer. And she was around £18, I think. Yeah, instead of the usual 25 to 30 I think she is normally. Um, I also want the um, Fairy Godmother doll. Yeah. And there's a picture of her on the back. Yeah, it matches pretty well, doesn't it? It does look like the actress. I've forgotten who the actress is that plays her now. But yeah, really nice. Really nice doll, that is lovely. Um, then, um, these Fashionistas were five pounds. Can you believe it? Five pounds each. And I bought all the ones they had that I didn't have. And then there was only three. There was this one, number 47. I haven't looked up the names yet, but I will do. So yeah, number 47. She's a, sh a short one, I think. She's got a molded on hat. And a little jean jacket. And it looks like her top and skirt are, are all one thing. Unless I'm... We'll see when I get her out of the box anyway, won't we? Yeah, so I've got that one. This one, who I think is a tall one. I love the colour of her hair. She's lovely, isn't she? She's number 33. Yeah, she's from a different line to that other one, I think. Yeah, she's from like the an earlier line, I believe. Yeah. Do have a few of those, but not many. And then finally this one, number 51. I'm calling it that because I don't know what the names are yet. I will look it up. Yeah, they all seem to come with an accessory, don't they? With a little, this one's got a necklace and this one's got, oh, she's got a watch on. And this one's got her hat. Yeah, so they do all seem to come with a, with an accessory a lot of them do come with these i've noticed they do come with these white pumps on she's got the white pumps on as well look yeah but for five pounds i thought that was brilliant then i got this now this i thought i already had claudine from the welcome to monster highline and i didn't and i got her from ebay for i think she was seven pounds so yeah, I was really happy to have her and now I have um, all three of the dolls in that line and I also have, um, I also have Frankie and Draculaura who come with more masks and things, they're like a more deluxe version. Um, and then I got this superhero girl, now I don't collect the superhero girls at all. But I just loved her face. I thought she was such a pretty doll. And I thought I could redress her. You know, she doesn't have to be a superhero, does she? She's got her wings on and she's got her arm things on. I'm sure I can take those off and just put her in a normal dress. Because, yeah, although I don't collect the superheroes, I really thought she was pretty. And I think she was £11. Was she 11 or 9 Yeah, but she's lovely, isn't she? The others... The other ones in the line seem to have the painted bodies and the moulded on clothes, but she doesn't look as if she has look. Her clothes and that don't look as if they are painted on or moulded. Might have to leave her boots on. I don't know whether they look quite big, don't they? But we'll see when we unbox her. But yeah, I really liked her. I thought she was really pretty dull. And then the last two ones that I've got are Bratz. I've got the Music Festival Raya. I think the only one I haven't got in the Bratz now is in the music festival line is um, Yasmin. I think that's the only one I haven't got. Yeah. 
yeah, she comes with her extra outfit and her hat and glasses and uh, little earrings and a wristband, yeah, and a massive shoes. Yeah, she's lovely, isn't she? Really pretty doll. Yeah, so that's her. And then finally, I mean, I have, I have had such a fantastic haul. Did really, really well and really, really happy and feel so lucky. Yeah, I really do. So, yeah. Yeah, the last one I got was um, Sweet Style Jade. I didn't have any of the Sweet Style Jade, any of the Sweet Style dolls. I've been looking for them. And you know, she was six pounds. Six pounds, I mean, just under seven pounds. And so was the Music Festival Raya, which I've paid four, well, I've seen they're usually four times that. And I bought some a few weeks ago with a 10 pound voucher. So that made them 14, but still, they're still half that, aren't they, even? This was in the Cyber Monday sale, so I bought all the ones they had that um, that I didn't have. And it was just these two. <laughs> yeah, it was just Jade and um, and the Raya. Yeah, but fantastic haul. Really great. I can't wait to get them open and, and get them all out and have a look at them. So, yeah, so I will be doing some unboxing and reviewing of these dolls. So... Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Bye for now.